the hl aerospace museum is india's first aerospace museum located at hindustan aeronautics limited this was established in 2001 in order to display various aircrafts and aerospace equipments to the general public this is the ticket counter at the entrance where you can buy the tickets to go inside you can buy camera tickets in order to take photos and videos inside the museum This is an aircraft called Canberra designed by English Electric Company. This is a multi-role aircraft used by Indian Air Force as a bomber, trainer and high altitude photographic purposes. This is an indigenously designed and developed multi-role light helicopter for defense and civil purposes with high speed performance and excellent survivability. This can fly at a maximum speed of 290 km per hour having a seating capacity of 16 people inside This is a meteorological radar used for detecting the weather conditions This is a radar used for air traffic control. It provides the positional information of various aircrafts. This radar has a range of 200 nautical miles. This was commissioned in 1967 and phased out in 1991. This is an aircraft called as Dove or Devon designed and developed by D Havland of United Kingdom. This is used for carrying passengers, pest control, light communication and ambulance duties. <laughs>
One of these aircraft is called Hansa, which is designed by National Aerospace Laboratories of Bangalore. This is a lightweight aircraft ideal for training, sports, and hobby flying. This flight is called Hindustan Trainer or ST2. This is designed and developed by Hindustan Aeronautics Limited used for the training of pilots. This was first commissioned in 1951 and subsequently phased out in due course. This is the full size heat shield of a PSLV or Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle. This is a chamber which keeps the satellite safe while the satellite is launched into the space orbit. This heat shield protects the satellite from burning while passing through the Earth's dense atmosphere. When the launching vehicle reaches about 110 kilometers, this is made to explode and fall off. This is the main building of the museum which consists of a large number of aircrafts and aerospace equipments. This is the demonstration of a toy helicopter which is fully controlled by a remote controlling device. This is an aircraft called Pushpak which is designed by Hindustan Aeronautics Limited to meet the requirements of flying gloves. This aircraft was under production from 1959 to 1971. This is another building of the museum which consists of large number of models of various types of aircrafts, helicopters and aerospace equipments. Most of them are just small models used for display purposes. Besides, there are a large number of pictures relating to the history of aircrafts.
visiting aerospace museum was not only an interesting experience but also a great learning on the aircraft and aerospace equipments it is a great place to visit for the people interested in the flying science